Discover the timeless genius of William Shakespeare in this captivating documentary. Journey with us through the life and works of the Bard, from his humble beginnings in the 16th century England to his enduring legacy as one of the greatest playwrights in history. Explore the intrigue, romance, and drama behind his iconic plays and sonnets, and unravel the mysteries surrounding his genius. Join us as we delve into the world of Shakespeare, where words become magic and stories transcend time. William Shakespeare, often referred to as the Bard of Avon, is hailed as one of the greatest playwrights and poets in the English language. Born in Stratford-upon-Avon in 1564, his works have left an indelible mark on literature, theatre and the arts. This comprehensive guide delves into the life, works and enduring legacy of this literary giant, exploring the profound impact he has had on the world of literature and the cultural landscape. Early years in Stratford-upon-Avon, William Shakespeare, the illustrious playwright, was born in April 1564 in the market town of Stratford-upon-Avon, England. His birthplace, a modest home on Henley Street, has become a pilgrimage site for literary enthusiasts. Raised in a family of eight, Shakespeare was the third child of John Shakespeare, a glovemaker, and Mary Arden, a daughter of a prosperous landowner. Though records from this era are sparse, it is known that Shakespeare's upbringing was in a nurturing environment, laying the foundation for his later intellectual pursuits. The grammar school education Shakespeare's educational journey began at the King's New School in Stratford-upon-Avon, where he received a solid grammar school education. The curriculum of the time emphasized Latin literature, rhetoric and classical studies, providing him with a strong linguistic and literary foundation. It is within these formative years that Shakespeare likely developed an appreciation for the works of ancient writers like Ovid and Plautus, influencing his future creative endeavors. Marriage and family life. At the age of 18, Shakespeare married Anne Hathaway, a woman eight years his senior in 1582. This union led to the birth of three children, Susanna and twins Hamnet and Judith. The circumstances of Shakespeare's marriage have sparked curiosity and speculation, adding a layer of intrigue to his personal life. Despite being absent from his family for significant periods during his later career in London, his experiences as a husband and father likely left an indelible mark on his understanding of familial dynamics, a theme explored in several of his plays. Mysterious Lost Years, the period between Shakespeare's marriage in 1582 and his emergence in London in the early 1590s is often referred to as the Lost Years. Historical records provide little insight into this enigmatic phase of his life, giving rise to various theories and speculations. Some suggest that he worked as a schoolteacher or a law clerk during this time, while others propose that he may have been involved in theatrical activities in London. The lack of concrete evidence adds an air of mystery to this segment of Shakespeare's biography. Arrival in London and theatrical beginnings. Around 1592, William Shakespeare made the decisive move to London, leaving behind his family in Stratford. The city was a burgeoning hub of culture and commerce, and the theatrical scene was thriving. Initially joining the Lord Chamberlain's Men, a prominent playing company, Shakespeare began his career in the theatre as an actor. However, his talents as a wordsmith quickly gained recognition, leading to his foray into playwriting and the subsequent establishment of himself as a significant figure in the London theatrical landscape. The ambitious transition, leaving the provincial confines of Stratford, William Shakespeare's journey to London in the late 1580s marked a pivotal turning point.